Well, hello there, fishing friends. And if you're new here, welcome. So on today's video, we're going to be going after the tarpon. This is the second epic fish for the US East DLC ocean. And we'll be going out to S1 today. This guy can be found on locations S1 and S2. And as you can see, it's found on the beach, the coast, and it is a bottom dwelling fish. You can catch this using the crankbait and the popper, which I find interesting since the popper is on the top. <laughs> but crankbait makes sense. The popper doesn't make sense being that it's a bottom fish. Uh, you can't get the popper to go down to the bottom. But uh, anyways, and we have the shiner. We'll actually be using the shiner to catch this guy today. So what we're going to do is head out to S1 and I'll show you how to catch him. Okay, so here we are on S1, Liberty Island. And we're gonna switch over here to our oops, float fishing. And like I said, we're gonna be using the shiner to catch this one today. And what we're gonna be doing is using the shiner and looking for bubbles. As you can see, since it's a bottom fish in the shiner, uh, there's really nothing else out here. We got, yeah, we got that one that's on a shiner. So we might catch that one as well. Uh, but I don't think there's very many others that that's on the top. So yeah, we might get the octopus catching this, and uh, but we'll also get the tarpon. So right, let me grab my fishing line here, drop it to the longest length by pressing my thumbstick down, and I'm looking for bubbles. I probably talked too much, and now all the bubbles are gone. So I'm gonna do a reset. To do a reset, all you do is go into your settings, go over to hard, back to expert. You do need to be on expert to catch epic fish and then grab my line again. And then you'll see swirls right away, and then shortly after bubbles, and we are looking for bubbles. Uh, it sometimes can help to stand if you have trouble seeing the bubbles. Sometimes you can see them if you're standing a little bit taller. Um, I don't see any bubbles. Another thing you could do is just kind of randomly cast out there to see if you can get a quick red line. Uh, if you don't, just quick retrieve it, pulling your thumbstick back. Do another random cast, see if you get a quick red line. Something like that. I don't see any more bubbles. Actually, I don't see any bubbles at all. So I'm gonna reset once again, and I'll keep resetting until I find some bubbles and get this guy in the line, and then I'll bring you back. There we go. That was just a random cast. Uh, I wasn't finding any bubbles, so I just started doing random casts to see if I could get it. See if this is it. Oh, I got a unique shark. I'll go ahead and let him go and cast to the same spot. As if you didn't know, if you get a unique, if you let it go, you usually don't catch it again. So I'm going to cast back to the same spot, see if I get that quick red line again. I think it was a little bit closer, maybe about there. And nope, I try a little bit farther to the right. Uh, there we go, there's the quick red line. Let's see if we get that uh, epic we're after, not a unique. There we go, that's better. Yeah, like I said, if you catch a unique, of course, if you catch a unique, you want to bring it in. I don't want to bring it in because that's not what this video is for. So, <laughs> I want to bring in the tarpon. <laughs> Uh, but if you catch a unique and you release it, most often you will not get that unique back if you cast in the same spot. Unlike catching epics and rares and stuff like that, or any other fish. Uh, similar to a shark, a regular shark. If you catch a shark and then you release it, most often if you catch the same fish that caught the shark before, you don't catch that shark again. So. Same thing with the uniques. If you release it, you don't catch the unique again. So if you ever get a unique, make sure you hold on to it. So. And there we go. There's the turban and my epic fisherman grade two. Woohoo! Epic. And it was my personal best. All right. Well, there you go. There's how you catch the tarpon. Um, if you find this video was helpful, make sure you give me a thumbs up. If you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button. We got another epic on the way, and then we'll be going on to the uniques, so you want to come back for those. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.